And now it's time for the D final. Men's turn free. And in lane number one at the bottom of the screen is Talmadge Davis from Team Greenville. Brandon Fabian is in two from Nation's Capital Swim Club. Three is Russell Noletto from City of Mobile Swimming. Four, Stephen Mount, Greater Pensacola. Five, Jonathan Spire, Southeastern Virginia. Six, Charles Swanson, Nova of Virginia. Seven, Justin Dunn, Jersey Flyers Aquatic Club. And eight, Aiden King from Iowa Flyers Swim Club. Aiden Keene's got about a body length lead. Do the guys in the middle of the pool know he's there? They might not. Maybe they'll peek over in this turn and see him. Aiden Keene to 54, 8, 8. He's got a big lead here. Aiden swam a 139.80 this morning in the short course prelims. That would convert to about a 153, 154. He's going to beat that by a lot. He's on pace to go 151. He's on pace to get the Olympic Charles qualifying time. If he can hold on, he's got to go though a 28, I think. So he's got to go 28, so we'll see if he can do it. He is sprinting hard. Look at the lead he's got. It's just substantial. He's putting everything he's got into this race. Aiden Keene in lane number eight. Looks like he's going to win. Will he get the Olympic Trials qualifying time? He's going to just fall off the pace. 153.06. And then in second out there in lane number two, that was Talmadge Davis, 154.81. So lanes one and eight. Getting what they call the outside smoke for one and two. Great swimming for both of those guys in the D final. It's really setting us up for these next three heats. 